Before heading over to the designing directly, it is important to understand the dashboard or the main panel of the Canva tool. That's why this video is dedicated to completely showing you how you can use the Canva dashboard. So this video is completely dedicated to Canva dashboard overview. We'll be giving you proper and detailed overview that which thing is where. So hey guys, welcome back to Marketing Fundas Global. This is the third video in this Canva course and in this video we are going to show you a complete overview of Canva dashboard. So without further ado, let's get into the video. So guys, I am already logged in into my Canva account and this is the simple overview which Canva has right now. Okay. So here are some preset designs which directly you can pick up. Okay. Otherwise, you can directly search here about the template which you want. Okay. But let's start from the very beginning. Okay. Design Spotlight. Well, guys, in Design Spotlight, we got all the categories or all the design categories which we might want in order to create our social media or in order to create any design we want. As you can see, logo maker, flyer maker, banner, poster, resume, then invitation, business card, video intro, meme, anything which you want to uh, start with this is here then we have collage maker graph and we have some other options as well and here we got if we want to some create presentation post stories insta post facebook twitter youtube and video ads anything which we want to start with that is here okay in the design spotlight section then if we go to business section we got some extra features that is important for business only for example create content faster engage these features are basically mainly for businesses who has some extra deadlines okay so if i click click on uh, one of these features let me show you create content faster if i click on this this will directly take you to this page okay and here is the button that says get canva free or you can try canva for teams so if you are a business you can try canva team as well but that is a uh, pro feature make sure and by can using canva team you can add or you can buy a Canva Pro for your team as well, right? So we don't have to do this thing right now. Let's go back. So this was all about business feature. Okay. If you want to use or if you want to leverage the main feature of business uh, tools, you have to buy a Pro. Otherwise, if you are a single or an individual, you can use like free as well. There's no any extra things. Then in education section, we have some extra things like teacher and school if you if i click on this i got this one so if you are a teacher okay you get uh you can get verified as a teacher and canva pro will be totally free for you yes canva offers pro features to the teachers if you are a teacher you can get verified with the id you have uh, teacher id or anything else organization id you have and you can get verified and once you are verified you will get all the pro features for free by canva so this is the good initiative by canva okay because this uh, empowers teacher and ultimately it helps students to learn more about these things right then we have student option if i click on this we got this uh, page here in student option we it says that we got some extra template library that other accounts doesn't get so if you are signing up uh, with your canva account sign up as a student it will be more beneficial for you okay then free teacher resources there are some resources and courses which you can learn about canva that how to design things and all right so this is free resources you can learn from these because learning doesn't get stopped okay and so these are some extra features LMS which means learning management system integration if you want to integrate canva with the LMS learning management system you can integrate that as well but as a business you don't need these things it is totally for educational purposes so uh, this was about education because uh, education section is mainly for uh, education purposes for students for teachers okay so i have told you all uh, all the main things that teachers can get free canva pro students get some extra templates so now let's talk about plan and pricing so we got three plans over here the first one is free and i have already told you that free 
uh, if you're using free platform free uh, canva that is enough to grow your business to grow your skill and to grow your net worth free platform is enough otherwise if you want to learn more about the pro features premium features then you can go with canva pro otherwise free platform is enough to go then we got team as i've already told you if you have an organization if you are an organization maybe uh, five people or 10 people or 20 or two, two uh, maybe you are 100 people team right you can buy canva teams and you'll be able to use canva uh, pro with one account which means your whole team can use canva pro with one account you just have to pay single time and all the team will be able to use canva pro so that's how the pricing works in canva okay and we got some extra resources over here blog design school events you can learn or you can know more about the events upcoming events then blogs uh, this is totally published by canva team okay let me just let's just go back to canvas home so this is the dashboard and this is an introduction video just close this one and here is the button if you want to create a design you just have to click on create a design and here is the option you get then you can search it here like uh, i want to create facebook post so i'll just search facebook and as soon as i type facebook here i got all the options related to facebook facebook ad facebook app ad cover event cover fundraiser photo then square post landscape landscape post frame everything each and everything about the social media platforms are available here and if i click on these options i'll get templates as well okay so this was about this section if you want to download the app you just have to click here and you'll get the link download canva windows okay otherwise uh, this was the uh, this was about the upper section head section we got some settings over here if you if i click on this uh, this is the account settings you can edit if you want to and then we got billing options over here if you want to add billing okay now if i click on this icon we got extra options like account settings which which is this right now if you click on this you'll be redirected to here then if you have any confusion or you want to get help from canvas team you can click here canva app if you want to refer your friend if you uh, refer your friend you get some extra credits which you can use to get canva pro like that then privacy policy and sign out button okay let me go back to canva home and show let me show you some main left features over here if i click on this hamburger icon we got some extra options hidden here okay we got template options project okay if I, if i click on this template we directly get all the template options over here okay you can search from these options but i was talking about project option let me show you if i click on project right now it is totally empty but you can save your projects in canvas uh, canva as well canva itself this allows you to save your project and you can use or you can edit those projects in the future as well so this is a very safe place to save your uh, files you don't have to directly download by uh, creating the project uh, maybe you you have created a design and you are afraid that uh, my design will get deleted by canva automatically but that is not the case it will be automatically saved into your projects otherwise you can create folders separate folders like uh, add new and here you can create folder and save your project into that particular folder as well so you can segregate the things as well right then we have brands well this is basically a pro feature but you can free you can use it for free for 30 days okay so this is a brand kit mainly uh, this helps you to create your brand image you can uh, this will help you to create your uh, main logo your font and the other color combinations by which you can design your website your logo your other things brochure banner everything right so this is a brand kit by canva then we got content planner this is basically a calendar okay if you are from social media background you might know about these things because when we manage a social media platform we need to create a content calendar so that we can uh, organize the things that on which date what we will be posting okay so this is for that purpose then we have discover apps these are the apps situated with canva okay canva is 
you can say expanding day by day they are adding more extra features they are adding more extra or third party apps in order to make them more useful right then they have added mock ups as well you can create some mock ups you can create t-shirt designs you just have to get the design and print it on this on the t-shirt okay so mock ups are also there in canva and below this we have direct canva team option then trash button if you want to delete something so this was all about canva dashboard okay this was the main overview complete overview of canva dashboard i hope you understood the points i hope you like the video and that's it for this video guys i hope you like the video if you do so please hit that subscribe and like button if you still have any question or query please comment down below i'll answer those questions in the comment section itself we'll meet you in the next video till then bye bye